Hi guys, I don't know what to call you yet. You should probably put that down in the dis uh, comments, not the description. That's my job. Whatever. Okay. Uh, this request is from Deviant Art. Okay. Deviant Art. The picture you are seeing right now is a request. Mm -hmm. I will put them and my Deviant Art down below. Their original picture, of course. Uh, any other questions? No. Okay. Good. So let me, let me see what time am I at? 39. Close enough. Oh no, it's on exact- I put it exactly at the right time. Whatever. So I'm watching the video currently, but I'm recording it separately. The audio separately. And I put the timings exactly correct. I'm proud of myself. So, um, I'm put, I decided I was going to put her in the most dynamic pose I could ever put her in. The pose that I put every character in. Every character I draw in. Almost all the time. So different. Yep, the only thing I changed up was the hand position for the, uh, her right hand. Um, but uh, the hand on the hip, the pose itself, no different. Um, the I did. I decided I wasn't gonna put all of her legs in because I, you know, I thought it'd be too much detail. But you know, well, I don't know. It's, I changed up a lot of things, uh, like her socks. They're not torn up like in the original and. Her gloves, they had been ripped at the tips, uh, apparently, and the fingertips were neon pink, and I decided I'm not doing that. So I just kind of left them like regular gloves. Um, oop, bada bada. Uh, when I was coloring the belt, I forgot to color it, uh, but I went back and fixed it um, in video. Her hat, I didn't want it sitting on her head, so I obviously drew it the way I just drew it. And, you know, commentating is fun. So let me tell you a story. I tried to set up an appointment for my son, who is a dog. His name is Zeus. I recently adopted him. Well, he's not fully adopted. I have to give the guy 90 bucks, but it's a long story. And I think I can describe that in another video if you would like. And I went to, uh, you know, set up a vet appointment in the, um, you know, what? I did, right? No, of course you don't. I set it up in Kentucky. I don't live in Kentucky. I live in Indiana. Anyway, so I set it up for in Kentucky, um, with the same city and name and pet vet name, I guess. Uh, I didn't pay attention to the area code when calling, of course, because uh, it was, I'm stupid. Uh, but anyway, so I set up that appointment in Kentucky, and I had to recently cancel it. And it was fun because, yeah, business. Anyway, the lady on the phone, she, we mentioned where we were from, and she said, oh, I'm there, from there too city and state and I'm like what are you doing in the same city but Kentucky huh how you do that how do you do that whatever oh well so we cancel it and I had to set up a new appointment with the proper vet may I tell you it's the proper one I swear same area code anyway so I set up the vet appointment, and it's due for December 11th, my friend. Oh, oh, you see right there? Yeah, oh, cutting it out. Oh, adding it. Mm. I decided along the way that I was going to do this, like make it like the reference sheet, uh, instead of just making it like a regular drawing. I thought, I thought it'd be a little more fun. Uh, that's why the video was sped up so fast. I sped it up 21 times 21, because... Uh, it was like four hours of drawing and I, I don't know, it's minus the sketching uh, part, uh, which usually takes me about an hour to figure out poses and uh, anatomy, uh, but uh, yeah, 
I normally use blue to sketch, but I thought pink would be nice to sketch because the character has blue in itself. Uh, also, this is the edgiest cowgirl I have ever drawn. It's the only edgy cowgirl I have ever drawn. Uh, so I decided I was going, you saw those little blue chunks, right, in the hair? I just decided I was going to, I don't I, I was going to assume they were highlights, so I made them highlights. Uh, yeah, and she didn't really have an eye color, and I wasn't going to make it black, so I just made it blue. Electric blue, purplish blue, I don't know what you call it. Yeah, so the, you can see that the gloves there. <sighs> Nobody has neon pink fingertips. I don't know if they were trying to do fing or finger nail polish, nail polish or something, and they just covered the whole entire finger or whatever. But I decided I was just gonna cover that up like regular gloves. And the boots, of course. I added the boots, and I liked the designs of the boots, and I'm pretty proud of me drawing the boots. Anyway, yeah, so that's that's that, the foldy of the bootsies. Now we're just coloring it in. Woo. Yeah, um, silence, I don't know. The eyes, I didn't really know what to do with it, so I just kind of clunked up the, how they, you know, you get it, you see it, you know what I did. Unless you're blind, then why are you watching my video? I'm not even... Oh, come on. Ah, no, I'm kidding. You can watch this video. Kisses. Anyway. Yay. I also decided I was going to rewrite what she said because it was really blurry when I, um, expanded the photo, what she wrote, so I decided I was going to fix that. So, well, this is the end of the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell me what you want me to call you down below. Uh, yeah bullcrap like that. Goodbye.